Hi everyone, I'm Mana. Today's topic is how to deal with stress. We can't avoid the stress as long as we live in this world. And each person has a different threshold for it, meaning that someone might feel stress in a specific situation, while another person may not feel stress about it at all. We are all unique individuals, after all. But important thing is to overcome stress and harness its power for our future. If we constantly let stress overwhelm us, our lives won't improve. So let's discover some strategies to build a healthy relationship with stress and make our lives better. I'm going to share five steps to help you release stress and I hope these bring bring you a sense of ease and happiness. The first step is getting enough sleep. Sleep is incredibly effective in helping us forget about the negative things. When you have a good night's sleep, you wake up with a refreshed body and mind, and you might feel suddenly those uncomfortable things don't seem like such a big deal anymore. They become small problems in the grand scheme of your life. You will feel a sense of renewal and optimism, as if something exciting and new is about to happen. The second step, and it's absolutely crucial, is to be your own ally. When you are feeling hurt or stressed, it's important to comfort yourself and not blame yourself. Remember, Never beat yourself up over it. Treat yourself with kindness and understanding. The third step you need to do is try to put yourself in someone else's shoes. Once you regain your composure, take a moment to reflect on why those bad things happened and try to understand the perspective of others involved. Stress often arises from different perspectives, beliefs, and habits. And you will realize that each person has their own way of perceiving things. Even a person causing you stress may feel the same level of stress as you do in that situation. Everyone is facing their own struggles in any given situation. So you might discover a great solution to resolve the problem that causing your stress. The fourth step is to take a positive approach to release your stress. If you simply ignore the problem that's causing your stress, your situation won't improve. So, and you might end up feeling more anger and frustration. So change your positive approach and take action to improve your environment. For example, Try approaching the person you have a problem with in a calm and kind manner. Engaging in a conversation and making an effort to understand each other. Another option is to change your own behavior, adapting a positive attitude where you don't let negative things bother you and face them with a smile. When you change your actions, you will notice that people around you also start changing their behavior. The final step is consciously show kindness towards others. When you show kindness to someone, not only will they be grateful, but you will also feel good about yourself. When you are stressed, it's common to have negative feelings and lose confidence, but this act of kindness will help you regain your confidence and bring happiness into your life. These acts of kindness don't necessarily involve giving or doing something for others, but rather showing understanding towards them. Don't take it out on someone. These actions will only backfire and leave you feeling guilty and even more stressed out. When you make an effort to understand other people's beliefs and thought patterns, you will be better equipped to manage your stress and make the accurate judgments about whether you should take actions to 
address the underlying problems or simply not be too concerned about it. Not feeling stressed may seem very easy and comfortable, but in reality, it can sometimes feel boring. Sometimes the stress actually gives you the energy to survive and make you stronger, or it can provide you with the opportunities to solve your problems. So it's better to have some strategies to deal with the stress rather than trying to avoid it. I hope my advice helps improve your life. Thank you so much for watching my video until the end. I would be happy if you hit the subscribe button. See you in the next video. Bye!